It is an amazing token minting service that can mint tokens like nobody else can, sign keys. It understands how to parse OAuth requests, SAML requests, all that stuff beautifully, but it doesn't contain state. State is actually in the directory service. So hits the directory service and says, can you give me the artifacts I need to make this decision? So I need the app, I need the conditional access policy, I need the user, I need the blah, 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 the authentication methods. Give me all that stuff so I can start working on it. Um, the directory of the service doesn't have the state of this customer. He's in Japan. So what it's going to do, though, it's not going to say no. It's not going to say 401. It will actually give a 302 and say, hey, this. so it has on its side something called a partition table. It has a full table of where every other customer is in the world. So it's not. it's able to answer and say, here you go. Here is the, the, this customer is actually in data center three, go there, right? So then ESTS will send that response back to the gateway. The gateway will try the request against this other data center. This other data center will say, lo and behold, I actually know what this customer's data is, gives the artifacts back. The service serves the request successfully. The gateway will then set a cookie or a session or a cache on its side that says, okay, next time this guy comes back, I don't do this dance again. I don't know where it works. Oh, okay. So the gateway takes you to the STS below it. The STS um, takes you to the DPX. DPX is directory proxy. Probably your, most of your audience would not have heard that name before. It is, think of it as a simplified version of uh, Entrograph that is focused on what the STS needs. So coming in from MS Graph, you can request users, groups, uh, you can filter by, source with, select statement, yeah. do whatever the hell you want with the directory. This is super optimized for what the ASTS wants. It's super optimized for queries about the user, the conditional access, to get the results of the authentication requests. That's it. If, it, if ASTS starts asking it about admin units, it will yeah, not answer. Yeah. <laughs> that kind of makes sense. So super, and this is also very helpful for your customers to understand about isolation. Graph is isolated from DPX. So when you're hammering away a graph with your bad apps, that does not affect your authentication traffic and, and vice versa, right? So it also is beneficial to the customer 